Law enforcement officers in Nevada County are seeing an alarming trend on the streets. Deadly doses of fentanyl, but it doesn't look like it. Counterfeit pills that are being sold as though they are a legitimate pill, but actually contain very dangerous levels of fentanyl, other synthetic opiates. You don't know what you're getting. Uh, fentanyl and opiates can become airborne. It's very, very lethal and very, very dangerous. The sheriff's office says the spike in fentanyl overdoses comes as the county has seen three times the number of opioid deaths so far this year compared to all of last year. Grass Valley police say it's a problem plaguing the I-80 corridor from Truckee to Placer County since the summer. It's definitely here in our region and people should be aware of it. Which is why Granite Wellness Centers want people to know their doors are open and they have resources at the ready to help. We had a substance use disorder epidemic, then we layered on a pandemic and people feel disconnected. There, as we all know, there are high rates of poverty, unemployment, stress, and we see that manifesting in increased anxiety disorders, increased substance use disorders, and other mental health issues. CEO Ariel Lovett says this year, 10 people in Nevada County have died from fentanyl versus none last year. The center distributing this flyer to warn people about the uptick, saying some people think they're buying Percocet when in fact it's a pill laced with fentanyl. They say it's an issue hurting all age groups from 18 to 60 years old. We're actually increasing services right now, knowing that this needs to be done. So I think during these feelings of isolation and aloneness, um, we really want to let people know that we're here. In Nevada County, Marley Martinez, KCRA 3 News.